the Nature Center. We've had this colony for four years. It took me, the first, the first year I only had six birds. The next year I had 12 birds. The next year I had 30 birds, and right now I'm the, right, right around the 30 mark, and I've already got 56 eggs in my nest. Wow. These birds are called purple martins, and they're coming to us as a migratory bird all the way from Brazil. Think about where Brazil is on your, on your globe, guys. These little birds have flown here all the way from Brazil. They're a migratory bird. So they're gonna hang out here with us until about late August, early September, and then they're going to fly all the way back to Brazil. You know what's even cooler? The babies that are born here, in other words, their eggs and then they're hatched, they're gonna come back to where they were born. So there's birds up here right now that were born here last year, flew all the way to Brazil, stayed there for their the, our winter, and then knew where to come back to. Isn't that amazing? Of all the places they could fly, they knew to come back to here. So it's really cool as I had to add another set of housing this year because I knew I was gonna have so many more birds coming back, or at least I hoped they were, okay? Miss Gisela Frigo over here, she is the president of the Purple Martin Landlords of North Texas. She's like the Purple Martin guru of really the nation. She's really leading it here in the DFW area, but everybody knows who Gisela is. So how to say hi to Miss Frigo. Hi, I'm Miss Frigo. Glad you're here. So it stopped raining a little bit for us, so we're gonna, we'll, we'll continue on. I actually wore my purple shirt today because it, what kind of, what is it called? Purple Martins. Purple Martins, obvious. And guys, it's really cool is they eat flying insects. Name me a flying insect you think they might eat. I'm gonna give you a hand right here, baby. Butterflies. Butterflies, awesome. Another flying insect they might eat. A fly. A fly, awesome. Give me one right here, babe. Dragonfly, awesome. Annoying awesome. Annoying Excellent. One. What's it? A bee. One more. Ooh, mosquito. Mosquitoes. They don't eat as many mosquitoes as people think they do, but it's definitely one of their delicacies. They like to eat mosquitoes. Okay? So if you see a bird walking on the ground, is it a purple martin? Most likely not. If it's on the ground, it's a purple martin. It's usually because it's hurt. But if it's walking on the ground, it's probably not a purple martin because I just got through telling you that purple martins eat while they are flying, flying right? So most likely they're going, that's not going to be a purple martin if you see one walking on the ground. Yeah, as I get a little bit closer to the colony, there's going to be some mama birds up there in, in my nest. And they're going to start flying out. They're a very social bird. They love people. And you know what's so funny? It's because I've had this colony for four years. You see how white, white my hair is on the top? Okay, when it's really, really sunny outside and the sun's hitting the top of my head, it's like a beacon. The birds actually recognize me. When I come out, they come flying down because they know that I'm, I'm going to take care of them. So look out here in the, uh, uh, here guys. See those small birds up there? Those are purple martins. Look behind you. There's two coming in. Those are purple martins. Those right here. Now, what's another way you can tell it's a purple martin? Can I show you something real quick? You may see a small bird flying around. Now, everybody do this for me. Okay, you see a bird doing this? It's not a purple martin. Because this is what purple martins do. Ready? Everybody go. go. Flat, 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 soar. Flat, 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 flat soar. So if you see a bird doing this the whole time, it's not a purple martin. Look up that one. Right see how they're soaring in? And they love to soar, guys. They love to soar. There's an insect. Isn't that cool? Hey, and guys, here's the other thing I want to ask you. She was saying that they come, that they go to Brazil, and then if they're born here, they also come back here. I want you to be thinking, are there any other animals that we've learned about or that you've heard about that makes that same trip at some point in their life? A bear?
that are about two years old or older are going to have all one color bodies. They're going to have all purple. All right, excellent. They're going to, in other words, all of their plumage, all of their feathers have come in and they've got a really, really nice, it's a dark purple. They almost look black sometimes, but it's a dark purple. So the mama birds, the mama birds are a little hard to tell, hard to tell but this is how I've learned it. So Ms. Giesler, tell me if I'm wrong. The mama birds are going to have some white on their, I'll call it white on their belly, on their breast, and they're going to have white up here underneath their chin. So white on their chin and breast, right here. The daddy birds are the are the boy birds that aren't quite old enough yet. They're going to have some white on their belly, but they're going to have purple on their chin as best they can. They're going to get some more purple coming in. So look up over there. Do that sort of close enough. Yeah. Go ahead. Miss Lisa is the expert. She's going to tell me. Poke ducks. Poke ducks. The second year birds that returns, they will be the, the male. They are males. And so what they do is after their first trip back to our locations, they will have like polka dots on them, purple. So it already shows that when they go back to Brazil, they will change the whole plumage and next year they will come back all purple like the babies. So that is how you distinguish uh, the different ages. Any questions? Now, okay, so if I'm looking at one and I can't see why There's a difference though. Uh, there's their males, and then there's the fully adult males. The ones that are all the purple, they are the adults. They are the adults. So see if you can spot one of the adult males. That means that they're all over two years old. They're all what? The adults are what? The adult males are all that purple color, even on their bellies. Mm -hmm. they're, 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 on you. That one, what do you think they're doing? That So my job, my job is a, I'm sorry, babe. So I said that they try to uh, catch insects right now in yeah. the air. And mostly these are not male because females are sitting on eggs. Are they still in there? But I, that's what I want to put yeah. it back up real quick. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so guys, what I want to do, my job is when they start laying their eggs, I take down the nest once a week and I check to see if all the eggs are safe, if any of the eggs have hatched, how the babies are doing. So that's why the word landlord, okay, helping to take care of it. So I've got some eggs in number three and I want you all to see what they look like, okay? So can I get one line? Then when everybody's seen the eggs, then we'll put it back up because the mama birds are probably freaking out right now. Um, I also want to mention very quickly, you go know, hands off, do not get too close, just enjoy it quickly and move on. Okay, I need one, one line. One line. Okay, if so we're not in the line, you go to the end. Okay, guys, can y'all do me a Can y'all? I want this to be my line leader. Babies, I want this to be my line leader, and y'all be behind me. How's that? That'll be easier to see. And I want you to count how many eggs I have in number three. Whenever you see the eggs, go ahead and look. <laughs> Mama birds don't like it when it's raining and I got their nest there. Isn't that beautiful? How many is there? We have, we have collated and phoned some eggs already. They are small. Lisa was telling me that Robert had told her. Mm -hmm. My goodness. Yes. They're way ahead of us. They're, we so we're, we're late. Uh, yeah. I mean, they're laying. I mean, no question about it. Mm. I mean, they're busy as all get out. But uh, you're, you're, you're. Uh, yeah, this year we, we seem like we do real good. Well, and we're really really happy. Are, yeah, we're a little concerned that uh, we're so late because it's mm. going to take us into the real oh, hot yeah. weather. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hopefully. Well, we got shades we put on yeah, the windows and yeah. all this stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah.